Well, let's wrap this up. We've fought, it's been it's been such a fun journey exploring the wilderness of, of the three of, the, of Pirate Island and looking to look for boat parts. We nearly finished our boat, and let's finish this off by collecting the last couple boat parts. Hmm. Let's see. One quarter worms, no problem. One half spiders, yep. One quarter pepperoni? That's disgusting! What kind of bird brain wrote this order? Now the monkeys want two toppings. But this order is tricky because the bottom numbers in the fractions don't match. It's a wild party, so let's keep on cooking. The monkeys want a pizza with these toppings. Two thirds. Bees and two sixths. Worms. We need one four bees and three eighths grubs. the monkeys wanted. Hmm, the toppings on that pizza don't match the toppings on the order. the trick. Let's take a look at the order again. Look at the numbers on the bottom of the fractions and find the largest number. Cut the pizza into that number of slices. Let's make a new pizza from scratch. And I'm really happy I don't have to watch those monkeys eat. Ugh. We can't keep those monkeys waiting. Okay. Now those crazy monkeys want one third worms and one sixth grubs. did the trick. Let's take a look at the order again. One third of six slices is two slices. <laughs> I'm glad we filled the order correctly. And I'm really happy I don't have to watch those monkeys eat. Ugh. They're still hungry. What a wild order. For this pizza, we need one half spiders and one six slugs. Let's 
start over with a new pizza. Correctly. And I'm really happy I don't have to watch those monkeys eat. Ugh. It's a wild party, so let's keep on cooking. Okay, now those crazy monkeys want one half slugs and two fourths grubs. on our journey home. Cool. Hey, Penelope, watch me juggle these coconuts. I don't know if that's the best idea, Sam. Ah, uh, stop being such a worry parent. What could possibly go wrong? Remember, Sam? We're supposed to make sure the pirates don't wake up. Close. Tell me about it. We better wait until the pirates go back to sleep before we try again. <coughs> wow, that was quick. Okay, here we go. <coughs> Good catch! That's the right one. <coughs> Oh, you completed another 
one. Keep going. You're marvelous. our base camp. I feel wonderfully mean and nasty today. So glad to hear it, sir. That's my captain. You're back to your ball. When I was just a baby rat, I grew up in the gutter. I searched for scraps of moldy cheese to share with my poor mother. But one day I crawled down to the dock and climbed upon a ship. And I have been a pirate ever since I took that trip. I look at me, I'm master of a fearless pirate band. We sail this seas and frighten every living thing we can. I, I command a pirate ship and wear a pirate hat. And I am proud to say I'm still a low-down, dirty rat. <laughs> but now there are two mangy swabs who've come to steal our cheese. They think that they can take it without even saying please. But I can guarantee that pretty soon they'll beg to leave Cause dirty Captain Ratbeard has a few tricks up his sleeve Arr, my crew and I are plotting, we've got some tricks to play That lion and that bunny will never get away I can hardly wait to see the fear in their eyes When they take a look at Ratbeard's terrible surprise <laughs> I love being bad Promise me you'll stay. <laughs> Sam fell for the old tourist trap. All right then. The sign says to put in seven. No flying carpet in here. Just this. Look at that! Reader can use that on her boat. Let's see what else we can find around the island. So what's the story? Is the boat almost done? Keep it up. You're doing a great job of finding those boat parts. You can see everything we have found so far. This is a life buoy. It floats in the water. 
If anyone falls overboard, we can throw this life buoy to help that person stay afloat. This is the port light. It's called that because it's placed on the port or left side of the boat. At night, it helps other boats see which way our boat is moving. These are blankets. It can get very cold at sea, so we need these blankets to keep us warm. We need to carry enough firewood to make sure we can cook and stay warm on our trip. I'm tired of swimming around just to catch a bunch of fish for that crocodile. Couldn't we just give him some money or something? I don't think that would work, Sam. Why not? Did you see any pockets on that outfit? Oh well, I suppose you're right. One. One divided by... Good going, Sam! Bumping into birds happy! One... One times... One times fifteen to check your fish equation. One times fifteen equals fifteen. All right. Six. Six times six. Two. Six times two equals twelve. Good job! Looks like you made the catch of the day. Eleven. One. One divided by. One divided by fifteen. One divided by fifteen does not equal fifteen. Dividing doesn't work with these fish. Try multiplying and one. Divided by... One... One times... One times... Fifteen... One times fifteen equals fifteen. That's just what the croc ordered. Four. Four times four. Four times. Only the equal sign fits in the last slot. Four times twenty-three. Four times twenty-three does not equal six. That's too big. Clear the last fish and try again. Four times four. Four times 
twenty four. Twenty four divided by twenty four divided by four. Twenty four divided by four equals six. That's the way to keep the crack eight. Eleven. Eleven divided by eleven divided by two. Eleven divided by two does not equal eight. Ah, uh, check your fish equation again. One of those fish doesn't belong. Eleven. 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 You need to fill this box with a number, Sam. Eleven. Sixteen. You need to fill this circle with a multiplication or division sign. Sixteen divided by sixteen divided by sixteen divided by sixteen divided by two. Sixteen divided by two equals eight. All right. Wow, over a million points. Awesome. Their boat is almost finished. It's time to get the catapult ready. Ratbeard and his crew take no prisoners. This rabbit and lion aren't leaving Pirate Island. Um, Captain, since they didn't take our cheese, why don't we just let them leave? Yeah. Then we can go back Rep to hiding boat parts around the island. Boom! Wouldn't be any fun, right? Being a pirate should be fun. Yeah. And this will be fun. When I say go, it's bye bye, bunny, and so long, lion. I'm going to be really careful this time. No way am I tripping over that diary again. There it is, and I'm just jumping right over it. Wait, Sam! Look out for that pit! Oh well, let's get started. It says here, move to 27. Next, go backward 10. Now, go forward 0. Look at that! No treasure at all! It's just a milk bottle. Wow! An antique pirate note! It says, see page? Fifty, one. Ah, uh, throw that back in the hole. Let's get going. The diary says, roll over to ten. Then, go forward three. Next, go backward nine. This isn't treasure, it's just this fake nose. Hey, look at that! There's a note! It says to flip the diary to page 76. Let's not bother with that kind of junk. Hmm, 
Let's see here. The diary says go to three. Then go forward 13. Now go backward 13. This is great! Real treasure! It's better than treasure! We need that part for our ship! You know, Penelope, if we ever get back to Wordville, I'd like to go to college and join the pit diving team. Why are you telling me this now, Sam? Well, I was thinking about starting to practice right now by diving into that pit with all the great stuff in it! Sam, no! Not again! Sam fell for the old tourist trap! All right then, the sign says to put in nine dollars and seventy-one cents plus one dollar and fifty cents. I can't believe I fell for this tourist trap. But I want to get out now! First, we have to put in another one dollar and twenty-nine cents plus fifty cents. Oh please, someone help me get out of here, please! Hey there! It looks like we need to add more money. Now the 
trap is asking for another eight dollars and sixty-nine cents plus sixty-four cents. It sure is dark in here. Hey, anybody? Mean, nasty pirate with a scraggly beard. <laughs> what was that noise over there? Mm -hmm. Um, nobody here but us talking pirates. Well, okay then. <laughs> well, Sam, it's time to change one of the. Won't this pirate ever leave? Maybe if you change one of the times, he would. Figure out what time the pirate is finished with lookout duty. Then, click and drag the clock's hour or minute hands to match the time on the sign. When the clock has the right time, click on Sam. If I find out who walked off the lookout job, I'll... Ooh, I'll... And then I'll... Oh, and then... Read when this pirate's lookout duty should end. Then set the clock so the pirate thinks he can leave. <laughs> Time to leave at last! Whoopee! There couldn't possibly be another pirate around here, could there? Not another pirate! Doesn't look like there's anybody here. I guess I'd better stay and keep an eye out. Squeak! Oh boy, time for fun! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Thank goodness that pirate finally left! Let's grab that part and run! This is pirate country, Sam. Maybe we should wait a minute to make sure the coast is clear. Not another pirate. Some pirate left this clearing wide open again. Yeehaw! I wish I could go to my next piratey job, but Ratbeard would be so angry! That time is just too early, Sam. <laughs> Can't I get out of here yet? That time is just too early, Sam. <laughs> Can't I get out of here yet? Time is a bit too late, Sam. <laughs> ah, sometimes it feels like lookout duty lasts all day. That time is a bit too late, Sam. Look, Sam, that pirate changed the activity she wants to go to. Some pirate left this clearing wide open again.
It's so nice to feel the breeze blowing through my mane. If you're quiet, you can hear the ocean. Sam, we're on an island. If you wear earmuffs, you can still hear the ocean. Let's make a sail that is shaped like a square and is two squares wide and two squares high. A square has four sides that are all the same length and four angles that are all the same. Your shape has too many sides. Try drawing the shape again. I need a sail that... <laughs> Won't that sail look just wonderful flapping in the wind? I'll let the sailmaker hold onto that sail until we need it. Wow! A fresh sheet of sailcloth! Let's make another sail. Let's make a sail that is shaped like a triangle and is five squares wide and five squares <laughs> Won't that sail look just wonderful flapping in the wind? Let's just store that sail right here. I could really use your help with making some more sails. I need a sail that is eight squares wide, four squares high and shaped like a triangle. What a fantastic sail! We'll need that sail when the boat leaves, but for now, the sailmaker machine will keep it safe. I could really use your help with making some more sails. Let's make a sail that is shaped like a triangle and is six squares wide and three squares high. A boat with that sail would go really fast. We'll need that sail when the boat leaves, but for now, the sailmaker machine will keep it safe. another sail. Can you cut out another one for me? I need a sail that is one square wide, one square high and shaped like a triangle. All right, you did it again. I'll let the sailmaker hold on to that sail until we need it. Wow, that's going to come in handy for fixing up the boat. It's about time one of us sang a song. I'm ready, Captain. Me too. Here it again. When I was just a baby rat, I grew up in the gutter. I searched for scraps of moldy cheese to share with my poor mother. But one day I crawled down to the dock and climbed upon a ship. And I have been a pirate ever since I took that trip. All right, look at me, I'm master of a fearless pirate band. We sail this season for writing every living thing we can. <laughs> I command a pirate ship and wear a pirate hat. And I am proud to say I'm still a low-down, dirty rat. <laughs> but now here are two mangy swabs who've come to steal our cheese. They think that they can take it without even saying please. But I can guarantee that pretty soon they'll beg to leave. Cause dirty Captain Ratbeard has a few tricks up his sleeve. Our my crew and I are plotting. We've got some tricks to play. That lion and that bunny will never get away. I can hardly wait to see the fear in their eyes. When they take a look at Ratbeard's terrible surprise. <laughs> I love being bad.
I'll be right back, guys. Sorry to hold. I don't want to hold the video too long, but I'm not gonna pause the recording because the sound will go out of stitch. So I'll just leave it like that for now. When I'm through with Reader Rabbit and that silly lion, they'll wish they had never sailed the seven seas. <laughs> It felt like the pirates were after me! Millions of them! Small, tiny, blood-sucking... Ah, stop it! Those were mosquitoes, silly! We'll catch that mangy lion and the fuzzy bunny too, pirate style. <laughs> We'd better start moving before the pirates find us. This is a really big island. This island feels creepy. Big! Try living on it for a year! Sorry guys, my dad needed me to do something. I'm back. Good to see you, Reader. Nice work on the boat. You two are terrific. Just a few more items and we'll be ready to sail back to Wordville. You can click on my clipboard to see the boat parts you have found so far. You can see everything we have found so far. This is the starboard light. It's called that because it's attached to the starboard, or right side of the boat. This is a telescope. We can look through the telescope to see things that are far away. This is a mask and snorkel. The mask allows us to see things underwater, and the snorkel 
lets us breathe while swimming underwater. This is the boat's rigging. Rigging helps keep the boat's masts standing straight. Sailors climb rigging like a ladder to go up the masts. Well, we only have one more part left to go. You know, to be honest, let's have a look at the credits. Let's see the names of the people who made this game. These people all deserve a credits for the game. Let's go back to the sign in and, and show you the practice mode. Start a new player. Find your name on the list or type it in. Let's go to the island so you can practice your skills in the game. In practice mode, all nine activities for icons for all nine activities on, are available on each of the three, on three sections of the island. When you change the levels in practice mode, it does not affect anything in the main game. This pizza order has only one kind of topic. They're still hungry. They like it. They really like it. It's a wild party, so let's keep on cooking. I drew one half of the sail. Your half of the shape is smaller than my half. Both halves of the sail need to be exactly the same, only flipped. Try drawing the shape again. I need you. <laughs> Your half of the shape is bigger than my half. Both halves of the sail need to be exactly the same, only flipped. Try drawing the shape again. The same. <laughs> the crocodile wants. Seventy three. Seventy three. Sixty four. Sixty four minus. Sixty four. Mi sixty four. Sixty four minus. Forty one does not equal ten. Those fish equal a number that is too big. The crocodile won't want to eat them. 64 minus... 69. The monkeys now want two kinds of toppings on their pizza. It's a wild party, so let's...
go back next go look at that no treasure at all now go for next go wait monkeys have a tricky order for you. You have to cut the pizza into more slices than the bottom number on the order. But you have to add toppings that are equal to the fraction shown in the order. It's a wild party, so let's keep on cooking! sides that are not the same length. They are. Good catch! That's the right one. with numbers that are between 63 and 68. Quit. Whoops! No pirates there. The barrel is just a decoy. Keep trying! Nice job! Have some bonus points! My treat! Yeah. 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 
is to change the time on the sign to match the time on the clock. When the times on the clock and the sign match, then click on Sam. I want to go weigh the anchor. That pirate really wants to... Not another pirate. I want to go fight Cheddar Rafting instead of being a lookout. We can make that pirate look <laughs> Oh, wow. Another one. I'm hungry. I want to eat dinner. <laughs> oh, wow. Another one. I wish I were swabbing that deck. <laughs> uh, pirate. I want to play for cheesy. Look out! Not another pirate! Uh, I want to go take a nap! Oh wow! Another one! My cabin is too messy! I needs to go clean it! Oh wow! Another one! I'm not very good at making treasure maps, but I have fun trying. Yeehaw. Oh, wow. Another one. I love to sing, especially sea shanties. Yeehaw. Yeah. No. I think. Well, anyways, I hope you enjoyed, uh, I'll have to go back Find to the main your name game on the list to grab the last boat part. Thank goodness you're back! We really need your help! Help us collect oh, pieces of the boat you press the so we can get off this island! Watch out for those nasty pirate you, traps along the, the way! Recorded, you press the coconut in a different location. In, in the previous last location, you press the coconut. It goes all the way over there. Sure. Let's grab that last boat part. That goes I'm, uh, um, not too sure. But I think the pirates are trying out some new barrels. Oops, looks like they found a barrel that works. We'd better get the water balloons ready. Let's do it. More pirates are trying to come ashore. But remember, the barrels marked with numbers that are not less than 100 divided by 5 are only decoys. Aye, aye. Ready? Nice job! Have some bonus points! My treat! It's working! The pirates are returning to their ship! That was wrong. are all wet. Here are some more water balloons. Go get them. We stopped another pirate. Those pirates are no match for us! Whoops! No pirates there! The battle is just a decoy! Keep trying! Aha! We're stopping those pirates! We stopped another pirate! Another chance! Let's see the pirates try to reach the shore now! Look at them retreating! Great job! 
Great job! It looks like you've given those pirates that sinking feeling. Hey Sam, the coast is clear. And look, there's something on the beach. Hey, it's a boat park. I'll go get it. We did it. Now we got over 1.1 million points. Our grand total is 1,126,950. Let's see the final country of the game. Thanks, Sam. Hand me those tools you found. I need them to put the sails on our boat. Wow, reader! The boat is all finished! It looks great! And it's built from the parts that you collected on the island. All, all right. right! I knew you could do it. You know, I think this boat is even better than the original sea lion. Thanks, Sam. Now let's set sail and get home to work. Oh, uh, guys, I hate to break up your party, but I see a few pirates. Oh, 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 oh wait. <laughs> Come on, reader, let's go. It's time to get the sea lion out of here. Shiver me timbers. Ooh, I've been waiting for this. Now we can throw our nasty secret pirate water balloon. <laughs> Don't toss it till you see the whites of their eyes. All right then, now! too heavy. If it's the last thing I do! Wow, that was great! I couldn't have done it without the two of you! Thanks, Sam. I wouldn't have missed our adventure for anything. You two sure know how to make a big finish! Congratulations, Sam the Lion, on finishing in first place! You are truly a champion! Well, anyways, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed the the playthrough of Reader Rabbit's Math Ages 6 to 9. Well, that's all for this playthrough. See you guys.